What's up everybody? Ricky Carruth here. I'm in my backyard right now. So I'm just out here pacing around, talking on the phone because I've been working out of my house for the last week or two on top of the fact that I moved offices and I'm remodeling my new office. We're also kind of self-quarantining, if you know what I mean. We're trying to stay out of the public um, and all that good stuff, which I'm sure a lot of you are as well. Also, like you guys probably saw on my Facebook post uh, in the Facebook group yesterday, me and Carla and I are buying a new house. This is our dream home. I can't wait for you guys to see this. I'm going to do a video of it. Um, this thing is amazing. It's got poured in place concrete outside walls, lifetime warranty on the roof. Um, it's got a, uh, it's got a pools of waterfalls. It's 15 foot ceilings. It's an amazing house. So I can't wait to share that with you guys as well. But what I wanted to talk to you guys about today is that the market is in transition right now. Okay. So we're at this point in the market where everybody's scared and we do not know what's going to happen. We don't know which way this thing's going to go. So where we are is, is we're waiting to see which way it's going to go. Um, and this thing could flatten out. The virus could, new cases could, you know, flatten out and the market kind of go back to normal within several months or something, or it could take a turn for the worse, which prices would probably go down. And there's all kinds of different scenarios, if you will. But the fact is, is that we don't know exactly which way it's going to go. So we're at this point of transition where everybody's just waiting to see. Once we know exactly what direction it's going in, then we can deal with that. If the market's going to go down, then we know we're going to bring our investors out and we're going to buy properties for cheaper. Um, if it stays the same, we're going to go back to business as normal, you know, so on and so forth. You know, it doesn't matter if the market's going to go up, down, sideways, whatever way it's going to go. Um, we know how to handle it. The problem is right this second, we don't know which way it's going to go. And that's why a lot of people put on the brakes. That's why a lot of people are hesitating. That's why a lot of people aren't going forth with putting their properties on the market or writing that offer or wanting to see properties or so on and so forth. And so what I want you to do right now is I want you to just stay on the phone, reach back out to your past clients, let them know that you care and just see what you can do to help them. See what they're thinking about in the market. See what they might be interested in doing in the future when the market does decide which way it's going to go. And just let them know that you're here to help them. Okay, so that's the name of the game. We just want to continue the relationships deeper through this time of transition. Let them know that we're here. That way we're deepening those relationships for the future. And who knows, you might run into a couple people that are ready to do something right now. I know a lot of sellers are reaching out to me. I have a good handful of them that are ready. They're getting nervous and they want to sell their property right away. So we have to price those properties aggressively right now. Get them out there, see what happens. So all you can do is put properties out there and collect the data from what happens. You know, is the property being shown a bunch? Is it not being shown a bunch? We might need to lower the price you know, so on and so forth. So just get out there and help people. We're in transition. This isn't going to last long. At some point, I'm guessing over the next two to four weeks, the market is going to decide which way we're going. Are we going to go down? Are we going to stay right where we are? Or are we going to start going back up again? I doubt that we're going to start going back up again. If anything, we'll stay the same or even go down. So either way it goes, we win. That's what I want you to know. Do not freak out right now. Stay on the phone. Keep that mentality of relationships over transactions. Keep getting out there and trying to help people. And everything is going to work out in our favor. I can promise you that. Shoot me a comment. Let me know what videos you want me to make next. And we'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Let's go.